A merry heart is good, like a medicine. So as much as I love to laugh, I should be able to fight off the autoimmune disease, headaches, muscle cramps, and joint pain, heartache, and feeling inadequate. I can do none of those things. But I have learned to enjoy my laugh. I have learned that it makes my tolerance for the pain more bearable. So when given the opportunity, I laugh out loud, allow my voice to fill the room, maybe create an infectious ripple that makes others join the chorus because I feel it so deep in my soul. It is my way to release the stress and heal my mind. This laugh takes control and becomes everything to my world in the moment. I'm not exactly sure when I realize that my laugh is boisterous or when I question how it makes others feel that I am so free to laugh so loud and never hold back bubbling sounds from my soul to teach the freedom of self-acceptance, the acknowledgement of my difference and reality of its beauty. Sometimes I just laugh to keep from crying. Other times I laugh until I cry because the tears need to be released and what better way for them to burst forth than from a smile that became active like a volcano and erupted from my gut to give way for cleansing grace. No matter what, my laugh will never be as astonishing as the sound of laughter catapulting from the lungs of my sons. When they laugh, the entire world is made perfect new creation each time they find the freedom to let joy overflow. I have taught them something by laughing out loud, a speechless lesson I hope they never forget as life becomes full of reasons to snatch your smile and your confidence. I hope they remember their mother laughing. I hope they find comfort in laying their head back, hand on their stomach, hearing a bellow from their soul and healing themselves with the medicine that I teach them to make each time I laugh.